is the road up to the hangar. You can see the hangar up there. Dan and Mike's house, and I believe that's the Grable's house, and we can see the Cochran's over there. We'll head down there in a bit. Right now we'll walk up to school. You guys will have to help me remember some of these houses. Man, I don't I think the old four square pad is gone. Looks like just a little garden or something left from those days. That's I think that's changed. I don't remember it being open like that. Many a game there. I believe that's the Elkins house. And there's first of the school buildings. The old radio shack. Looks like a ghost town, doesn't it? Crazy. I was talking to the, one of the caretakers here, and he says they keep this in pretty good shape because uh, religious groups come in for um, retreats here the old school. Man, I think that was the class. We had Spidell, Gary with the big paddle. I believe this is where a lot of those pictures were taken. A lot of those school pictures. There's a bit of a plantation there. They Extra money, the guy said. I need extra money, so he plants some cassava. And I'm guessing that's Fletcher's house over there. Still remember putting one of my radio control airplanes in, or the free flights into the roof, putting a hole in the roof. You guys remember Hollywood riding up here? Remember what was it, his name was Ron? Uncle Ron? No, maybe it was some. I can't remember. Getting too old. Over the fence. 
Here's the old road up to the airport. That's looking back down the road. Back up towards Katanglad. And I've only got about a minute and a half left here on this clip. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> This right here is pretty much what the runway looks like. The east-west runway. You can see it through there. It's totally overgrown. North-south runway is down there. There's some sort of an airsoft paintball field that they'd set up originally. Now it's just a grazing field for cattle. And I think that's pretty much it for this clip.